There was once a very old man whose eyes had become dim, his ears full of dull of hearing. His knees trembled, and when he sat at table, he could hardly hold the spoon and spill the broth upon the tablecloth or let it run out of his mouth. His son and his son's wife were disgusted at this, and so the old grandfather at last had to sit in the corner behind the stove, and they gave him his food in an earthware bowl, earthenware bowl, and not even enough of it. And he used to look towards the table with his eyes full of tears. Once, too, his trembling hands could not hold the bowl, and it fell to the ground and broke. The young wife scolded him, but he said nothing and only sighed. Then they bore him a wooden bowl for a few halfpence. out of which he had to eat. They were once sitting thus, with the little grandson of four years old. Look, thus, when the little grandson of four years old began to gather together some of his wood upon the ground. What are you doing there? asked the father. I'm making a little trough answered the child, for father and mother to eat out of when I am big. The man and his wife looked at each other for a while, and presently began to cry. Then they took the old grandfather to the table, and henceforth always let him eat with them, and likewise said nothing if he did spill a little of anything. Uh, see how short that was. Um, and that was the very short story of the old man and his grandson. Join me again next time as I read to you the short story of the Waternix. Until then, take care.